Hi, this is Meta from Metamorphosis Designs, and today I shall be I will be showing you how to make this truffle tree bracelet. Bracelet slash charm. You can make it a bracelet by just, you know, adding a C clip and bracelet. <laughs> well, I just threw this one together. It has the truffle tree poofy thing, and then it comes down with a single chain. You can make this anything you want. I just made it a single chain and Okay, let's get started. You take the bands that you want for your Creflo Tree top today. I will be using orange. Place it on your fingers like this. Like this, see? Then you're going to grab another two. This should be, this should, I like to do this double banded because it just gives it a better poof. Just gives it a better poofy thing. Just give it a, be a better poof. And if you want to do it um, single banded, you'll just have to make a lot of them. We're going to make about 20 of these. If you're doing double banded, I don't know, like make 40 of them if you're doing a single band. Go through this top here, or no, the back of this first band, see, of the top band. Take your finger in, grab this one on the bottom, and pull it. Oops, ow. And see, you made a slip knot. You made a slip knot. If you are not comfortable with that, you can just take two bands, put it through here, and grab the other one just like that. And then there's one last way, which you should probably use a hook for. And it's like this. Put it under like this. Bring it under like this. Bring this bottom, have a bottom band. See, like this. Oops. Like so. And come in. Grab those, these two. And pull through. I think it's easier to do the first way on my fingers, but whatever, it's ever most comfortable for you. So we're gonna make 40 of these. 20, finally. <laughs> it was kind of hard. Okay, now let's count. How much? Now let's count all of our band, our band. Let's count all of our slip knots to make sure we have 20. One, two, four, Six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty. Great. Okay. Now I know they look kind of weird, but we are just going to take them, put them on our finger like this. See, like this. All of them. Two of the nuts. There should be a, two little guys dangling down here. Oh, and, uh, now if I uh, go too fast for you, you can always just pause, and you can always just pause. But if you do have a rainbow loom, if you do have a rainbow loom hook or crochet hook, you would, you're gonna want to do this on your do it on your hook instead of your finger because I know it kind of hurts to do it on your finger. So if you do have a crochet or a rainbow loom hook, it's just better to do it on your hook. But I'm going to show you how to do it on your fingers because I'm just saying. Hi, hi, Key. Sorry, that's my cat. And I'm going to and this is, it's just super cute, this little truffle tree. And I just love it so much. It was my first original design. I'm going to, put, I'm going to be putting up um, other videos, like I, my next one is going to be really awesome because it's gonna be just so cool. <laughs> and so this kind of building, maybe if it all goes up to your finger and you can't fit, fit any more on, just scooch them down. 
and like this. Oof, so it's not cooperating. Um, ah, here we go. These ones kind of, some of them kind of come out weird, but they do. Once you mess fuss with them a bit, they'll be perfect. Now put like oh, darn. See? Not cooperating. Okay, we have them all on our finger like this. Now comes the hardest part. For the truck, I'm going to use gray and white. This gray and white. So I'm going to grab a gray. Now this is the hardest part of the bracelet, honestly because it's actually a pretty easy bracelet. So just put, okay, put it like this. But you're gonna put it like this, okay? Just on your fingers like this. Look at it all on to it. So like so. Uh-huh, just put it all on there. Super easy. See, like so. But if you're using a crochet hook, it's gonna take your your band the band for the trunk and just pull them up along. Make sense? Ooh, this feels cut of kind of cutting off my circulation. Feels way better. So now I'm going to take my white, put it on, and then take another gray because I'm going to be doing a fishtail for my trunk because I just love the look of fishtails. They're my favorite bracelet. I'm just gonna tuck this through there so it goes out the back. Like this, see? Okay, grab another white. Put down. Grab a gray. Fingers, my fingers are a bit pink. See, right? My fingers are getting kind of red. See, from from holding all these bands on it. So, don't be alarmed. Be alarmed if you if your finger if your finger gets a bit tingly, just hurry up with putting it putting all of those on your fingers. <laughs> okay, and it's best to do a three color pattern when you're doing a fishtail because when you loop a certain color up, when you loop a certain color up, you're gonna put that color on next. That's that's your color that you're gonna put on. But I. I'm doing a two color scheme, but it's just the one at the bottom we're gonna put on. So now white's at the bottom. I'm gonna put a white on the top. Okay, I have reached the end of my travel tree. If you want to make a bracelet, I shall show you how to do that now. You take it, and you have two on your, I have two on my fingers. Okay, now I'm going to take this, put it on this finger, like this. If you're making a bracelet, if you're making a bracelet, if you're making a charm, you're just going to put it over like that, and we got a simple slip knot, see? But if you're making a bracelet, you are going to take these two, and take a clip. Where did you Clip it and take it and clip it on these two. See? And bring it up. <laughs> bring it up. And see this, fir this first band, this first gray band for me. It's gray for me. You're just going to clip it on that. See? It's a bracelet. Oh, that's way too tight. But I want it to be a charm. So I'm not going to have a stick clip at the end. I'm going to have a stick clip. So take it. Uh, I'm so I'm going to take it off the stick clip. Ooh, come on. And just loop it over, like so, and make a slip knot. And there you have your truffle tree charm slash bracelet. I hope you like it. And it's all on your fingers. You can use a hook if you want. It's really adorable. I just like it so much. And thanks for watching. Bye.